Hi guys, I am going to do a small haul video today. Um, this is more Reborn stuff. I don't think I have anything else Reborn related coming. Um, I will take you off the tripod in a bit and show you what else I got because that is in the garage. Um, but these are some things I need to get put away, so I'm going to do the haul. First off, I got this Scentsy Buddy. And he is a bee. He is super cute. I have been wanting him for a while and he's like hard to find. I had saved one on eBay. He's no longer made. I had saved one on eBay and before I could afford it, it sold. And then I had found a couple on Macari and they sold. This one came up and I told my husband, I'm like, I really have been wanting this for like a year now. And every time I find one in my price range, it sells right away. And he goes, well, put in an offer, because it was an offer one, and see if the seller will accept it. And they did. So I got the bee, and he's super, super soft. Scenty Buddies are soft. Um, so he's like this mustardy yellow color and black stripe on his main part of his body. He has black legs that are like a, almost... Chanel type material and then the ends of his feet and hands are just this soft mustardy yellow color on the back he's got these big wings that are that mustardy yellow color and they've got an embroidered pattern on them and then there's the zipper in the back where you put your scenty pouch I do not have one in here right now um, I plan this year to do the consignment sale my husband and I talked, and I've gave it a year break. The spring one was actually canceled. And the one last fall, it was right when we were moving. I had had those issues in the spring when I did the sale. Um, this year, I am, or this time, I am not selling any clothes. That's just too much. Um, I have not really ever done well selling clothes at that consignment sale anyways. Um... I'm going to be selling my Baby Jogger City Select. I decided to just keep the black one that I have the double, or the two seats for, and then sell the silver one as much as I love that pretty brand new frame. Um, I'm going to sell that one, and then I'm going to sell my Baby Jogger City Mini because you'll see later what I got. Um, I love my City Mini, but... I have too many strollers. I'm just going to go down to the two. I'm going to have the City Select and then I'm going to keep my City Versa. Or, yeah, City Versa or City Premier, which is its predecessor. So I'm going to keep those two and then the one that I have that I'll show you later. I'll keep those three strollers. I'm going to sell two. I'm just trying to clean up my garage. Um, and I've got some other big items that I'm going to be selling. I've got some like baby toys and stuff like that that I plan on selling. Um, some toys of my kids that I plan on selling. So I'm more so going to be selling bigger items that typically bring in more money and make it more worth my time. Anyways, back to my bee. Um, he's got this face that's tan. He's got these big eyes that are white and a mouth and his head's mostly black. And then he's got these two yellow antenners. So I was super happy to get him. Um, and then a while back, I got Macy and Maisie, those cute llama bottles. Well, I was shopping at the same store, and I found this super cute um, space bottle that's got a rocket ship, another rocket ship, Saturn, I think this is supposed to be the moon, and some shooting stars all over it, and it's blue-tinted um, bottle for Sean. And then when I was at that store, I mean, I don't need any more blankets. But I saw this, and I just had to pick it up. How stinking cute is this? It is a llama little neck pillow that's got some pink llamas with light, hot pink llamas with um, light pink blankets. And then some aqua llamas with some hot pink blankets. And then, uh, there's one right here. A uh, light pink llama with an aqua blanket. And it's just like one of those neck pillows or like a head pillow which I don't, I have one that Crystal gave me, but it got packed away when we moved, and I honestly can't find it. So I thought that would be nice, 
kind of prop up heads and then it came with this super super soft blanket it's this it's not really hot pink but it's not it's like a bright pink and then it's just the body of it's just all pink and then the edging is that same llama pattern i saw this at the store and i had to get it it's called blanket and neck pillow set the blanket is 30 by 40 and it's by la baby favorite um so i picked up this set i thought it was super super cute um then we were at ikea and i don't know why this wound up in here um, for you, those of you that don't know, Ikea and their family bathroom offers um, feminine care products as well as diapers. And when we had gone in there, somebody had let their child play with the diaper machine. So there was a bunch of diapers um, sitting in the machine. And I left the ones that were sitting in the machine, but this one was on the floor. And I figured no one's going to want to use a diaper that was on the floor. So I picked it up. It's super cute. It's got a whale on it. It's a size 4 and it's got this blue whale on it and then it's got these aqua and gray waves on it and then the back just is the waves. Um, like I said, this one was thrown on the floor. The others that were in the machine, I left. I just picked up that one when my kids had to go to the bathroom. Um, then I also, I had these um, Bowden pants um, baby Bowden pants for Sean and I didn't have anything to match it this isn't a perfect match so um, it'll have to do for now I got this super cute it the pants are gray with white stars and then the kneecaps are kind of like this dark blue I got this shirt which actually might work because these pants are reversible I'm gonna pull them inside out or, there we go see they're reversible they've got a pocket on the inside too as well oh the uh, star side doesn't have a pocket um so okay the tag's in the pocket so this this might actually work now that i have them flipped this way and then roll the cuff okay that will work so these are reversible bowden pants i got this really cute t-shirt to go with them and the dinosaur is a different color blue, but the some of the detailing on the dinosaur is the same color as the pants. So now it'll work now that I have them inside out. But the shirt is gray and it's got this blue triceratops on it. It's like cold, like a blue color. He's got some white spots and some of like the darker blue detailing that matches the pants. And then his horns are all neon green. And I thought that would look cute on Sean. Hopefully you guys are you seeing it yep and it's just a t-shirt and then the neckline is the same blue as the dinosaur and then i got this for miss macy it is this janie and jack three to six month swimsuit i could not pass this up it is a um it's got a rash guard top instead of like a bikini top that will work perfect because of her cloth body it's a white rash guard and it's got like these beach umbrellas all over it and some sailboats. And at the one top corner on one of the shoulders, it's got this cute little um, white and peaches colored stripe, or it's not really peach, more like a salmon-y color striped bow. And that's the same color that the bottoms are. And then around the hips and at the arms, it's got this little frilly white. I thought that would be super, super sweet for Macy. And then last in this haul is some Oshkosh Bagosh overalls. They look a little big, but I know which baby it's for. So um, these are six months, yeah. So if you remember in one of my other hauls, I got Noah, um, where was I when I, we got that? It was a super cute um, Oshkosh um, button-down shirt, and I loved the shirt. I thought it was super, super cute, um, and I thought it would look adorable with some overalls. And I found these dark blue denim overalls that will look really cute with it. 
even if they're long, I can kind of roll up the bottom for him like that. Um, and these are carpenter overalls, so they've got the little hammer and screwdriver pocket. It's got the pockets up at the top. It's got a snap on it. So he will look, this, oh my gosh, he will look adorable in this for fall. I cannot wait till it gets cooler out to put this with the button down shirt. And then my kids are going to be doing distance learning um, for the first nine weeks of school. And that will bring us into sometime in October. And um, my kids were already asking about going to the pumpkin patch. So one of the days we may have them, I mean, I don't know what the days are going to look like for school. I mean, obviously it's going to have to be subjective on how their school days look and stuff like that. But I may check in to see if one of the pumpkin patches is open during the day. We have a couple of local ones. Um, there's one that both of my kids went to. I can't say both of them did. My daughter got sick that day. Um, in first grade, uh, my son went to the pumpkin patch with his class. Ironically, he got sick at the pumpkin patch. We had to leave. Um, I was there, so it wasn't a big deal. Um, then, the year my daughter was supposed to go, she got sick and couldn't go. Cause she didn't even go to school that day because she got sick. Or she couldn't even go to school. Um, but we have taken our kids to that pumpkin patch before. Um, but there's another pumpkin patch that the school utilized this past year that I would like to try. Um, I've heard better things about that pumpkin patch than the one that we've been to. So I'm going to see about possibly doing a field trip to the pumpkin patch and being it'll be during the day and hopefully not super busy. I would love to take Sean with, um, dress him in that and get some pictures at the pumpkin patch with him in that. Sorry guys, I, I, I'm opening up the blanket and there's like 8 million um, of these, those plastic things. So there's the blanket, it's just a pink blanket. And anyway, so I was going to show you the other thing. Okay, cover you up so you don't get sick while we walk. Um, but yeah, that's my plan. So here we go. Don't mind the broken TV in the background. So, I don't believe I ever did a video for this. I got a Baby Jogger City Elite stroller. I don't remember if I did one or not on this stroller. Um, it is like a jogging stroller. Underneath there is the tray. It uses the same adapters as the City Mini. I did not have any adapters for the City Mini, so I went ahead and purchased the adapters right here for my Cybex stroller. Um, I'd love to find the ones for my um, Kiko stroller, but I don't right now, so it's just got the Cybex one on it. But I really like this stroller. It folds up like the City Mini, um, but it does have the bigger jogging tires, like the tires are seriously the same size as the City Select tires. Um, the reason why I got this, because if you remember, I got that City Mini for when we fly, plan on flying to North Dakota next summer. And um, the problem with the City Mini is the weight limit for it is only like 40 pounds. It's got a pretty low weight limit, which I mean, the stroller is lightweight and it's a light frame and whatnot. So, I mean, it makes sense that it has a lower limit. Well, this beast right here takes up to 75 pounds. Um, my son is obviously over that. My daughter is way under that. I wanted something that can do more weight. I mean, if I absolutely have to put my son in here for whatever reason, I can. He's a little bit big. He kind of scrunches into it, but I am able to still push him in it. I've tried it. Um, my daughter, I can push in it no problem. I can throw their bags in it and run through the airport. In fact, the lady I got it from, it was in rough shape. 
I got it for a super steal um, because it was in rough shape and literally it just needed to be washed up. So I cleaned it up. But the lady had told me that her son just turned 11 and they go to Disney every year and they bought it because it had a high weight limit and their son is on the spectrum and he was a runner. And she said he finally got too, too big to the point where they really couldn't even push it anymore. So that's why they got rid of it. Um, she said they ended up getting a um, medical um, stroller slash wheelchair for him for trips like that. So it was time to get rid of this one. Um, it comes with already, it, it has a parent council attached onto it, but I added another one on. So I cannot wait if, when we go to the pumpkin patch, we'll be taking this with. I know I've so, showed in another video, I got a new car seat cover for my Atten. Um, I went with the orange and red motif. Still kept the red plastic part that I couldn't change. But um, I'm really liking the red and orange better than the all red. I'm not a big fan of red anyways. So I gotta sell that, but. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see everyone next time. Bye.